Welcome to the Northern Care Alliance. We're here in one of our digital experience centres at Salford Royal and we're really looking forward to taking you through a range of the digital initiatives that we've been working on over the past three months. Here at Salford Royal Digital Experience Centre, you'll find four zones. This is our COVID-19 digital response zone. This is where we've enhanced a number of products and initiatives from our Salford Global Digital Exemplar programme. Hi, I'm Dominic Shaw, I'm one of the SD4s in intensive care here at Oldham. So the Vasira is a um, hands-free communication device um, that I'm wearing here uh, and allows us to talk to other healthcare practitioners that, are, that have got the Vasira. So on our critical care, the consultants have got them, our anaesthetic colleagues that are assisting our intubations have them as well as the, um, the more junior doctors and uh, our nursing staff have them who's in charge of our uh, intensive care pods. It helped because we can wear it underneath the PPE that we're uh, utilising uh, and given that it's hands free we don't have to doff and um, interact with a, with a phone or, or any other device in order to communicate across the entire site uh, effectively. Here in Zone 2, we showcase the current NCA digital projects. In addition, you'll see the Global Digital Exemplar Fast Follow initiatives that are currently being held over at Pennine Acute Sites. Here in Zone 3 is the Salford-led Local Healthcare Record Exemplar Programme. This is where we focus on frailty, dementia and how we've repurposed some of the technology for the COVID-19 response. So this is the um, shared care record that we've designed in the Clinical Design Authority, uh, which is around frailty and dementia. And uh, essentially what it does, it pulls demographic data from the GP system. Uh, so the patient's details, their GP details. You can input things around accommodation um, and where they live and whether they're independent or uh, have carers and support uh, and also the access to that property. I think it's really good for us as community services that we'll actually all be able to see what each other's doing so that we're not duplicating our work um, and it's not causing us additional work to do. But I think from a patient perspective as well, it's good that the patients don't have to keep retelling different health professionals the same information over and over again. By having a record that's being able to be written into at any point in that patient's journey allows for that single version of the truth that we talk around. So it allows for not only hospital clinicians but also GPs and healthcare workers to update and upload that information straight away. And I don't think we've ever had that in the NHS before where we've had bi-directional flow of information between primary, secondary care and community care. And finally, Zone 4. This is where the local healthcare record exemplar platform, the GDE products and the Digital Experience Centre innovative methodologies all meet, in particular to support two projects. The first, which is around the NCA Virtual Hospital, and the second is risk stratification of patients with multiple long-term conditions. This is a product called FibriCheck that we've been asked to look at in the digital factory. And what this does is it monitors the rhythm of your heart. It's a very simple app to use. And the reason we've been looking at it is that um, cardiovascular uh, problems in Manchester are one of the biggest reasons why people under 75 are dying. In order to use the app, it's very simple. Basically, you just press start here on the top and you will notice that the camera uh, on my smartphone has activated and then all I have to do is just place my finger here and then it detects my pulse. I have to sit still for approximately 60 seconds and at the end of that I've got a reading of my heart rhythm. I get a report each day and the idea with this is that you take your readings twice a day 
and at the end of the week you get a consolidated report which feeds through to a healthcare professional and also the app is written with uh, APIs so it means that the data that's been collected this way can be shared uh, as part of your personal health record. A fantastic example of our agility in pace is the most recent ask and that's to introduce thermal imaging to protect both our staff and patients coming in and out of the hospital. So hopefully that's given you a real good feel for the range of technologies we're currently investigating to support new and emerging models of care. We're really excited. We've got the right methodology, a real agile approach, new products, open platforms, and a team and a facility to really drive this agenda forward.